What's going on guys, Rix here, and uh, today I got a pretty funny gameplay for you on Cargo, and uh, I've been doing pretty good for the past uh, four or five games before this game, and uh, apparently one of my teammates, I believe his name is I Harley Quinn, uh, he thinks I'm hacking, uh, along with some other guys from the other team, so uh, they're getting pretty pissed off at me for some reason, and obviously they have no proof. But uh, they just got really pissed off, and I guess a few people co were complaining. And uh, if you've seen one of my previous videos of Black Ops 2, where there's this camper that uh, kills himself with his own uh, bouncing Betty. Uh, I think his name was Reaper. Uh, he also thought I was hacking, and he was in the lobby previously, and he saw me again. And I killed him a few times. He lost and left. So I think he kind of uh, got them a little bit riled up, and now they think I'm cheating because I've been doing so well for the past like five or six games maybe and uh, they're just really really bad at the game to be honest and uh, I just keep destroying them this game and you can see right here this guy is just trying to get in the way I mean <laughs> I don't know why he's so angry but uh, he should be happy that he's actually winning more games but for some reason he's upset and now you're gonna see uh, throughout this gameplay he's just gonna follow me and uh, right there he actually got me killed for once so uh, that's pretty annoying, but uh, you'll see later on, it doesn't mean anything, uh, and uh, he's just really mad for some reason, but uh, for some reason, I don't know why people think if somebody's good at the game, they're obviously hacking. Uh, I guess their ego or something gets in the way that they can't understand that somebody's just better than them at the game. But uh, I had some uh, pretty funny kill cams, so uh, I had one where I was shooting a guy through the wall because I saw him on the uh, VSAT. And everyone was like thinking I'm wall hacking and screaming and getting all upset. Uh, but that that play right there is really funny too. That guy got turned on. But uh, right here um, in this game, I'm using some higher streaks. And uh, somebody told me that uh, running higher streaks is usually the best way to carry a bad team. And I have to agree because, man, when I play Black Ops 2 or Black Ops 3, all I get is bad teammates. Like, when I get in a game with somebody who can actually, like, shoot people and, like, does half-decent, we completely destroy the other team most of the time. But, uh, all I get is just these bad, bad players. I don't know what it is, but, uh, I think it m must be, um, uh, my score per minute. Um, because my KD right now on Black Ops 2 is, uh, pretty good. It's 2.62, uh, nothing spectacular, but for me, I think that's pretty decent. So, uh, my Black Ops 3 KD is pretty bad, though. Um, it's gone up a lot. I've uh, brought it up a lot since getting the Dark Matter camo and completing a bunch of other challenges. Uh, but still, it's not really that uh, spectacular. But uh, my score per minute is really high. Uh, much higher on Black Ops 3 than Black Ops 2 uh, because of specialist uh, weapons and uh, all that other stuff. But... Uh, Man, I just get the worst teammates, but I really found that uh, using high streaks, if you could stay alive to get them, you can carry a lot of bad teams, and I think it really comes down to how well you can do. Uh, sometimes I get into games where uh, I get put into games and I'm losing by way too much to come back, and that's just annoying, and really at that point you can't really do anything. But uh, in the games where you just start out and you just have trash teammates, uh, getting on those high streaks and... Uh, Getting stuff like your VSAT. Your VSAT helps out tremendously, uh, obviously. But um, other ones, like I'm running the dogs this game, which I never run, and I actually completely forgot the dogs were even in this game. But they are really awesome. I love the dogs. And uh, you see me pick them up right here, and they uh, do some work. But uh, running high streaks is definitely probably the best way to carry all these bad teams uh, because you definitely can't rely on your teammates in this game. And I like to usually try and play with like one other person who's good or uh, half decent so that it makes it a lot easier because I just get these guys that just feed the enemy team and you know I can only do so much and then once they start feeding them for streaks then you know the lead starts to blossom and they get you know too high uh, they get up by too many points so that makes it even harder to carry uh, all these bad teams. And uh, this gun that I picked up, the MSMC with rapid fire, is absolutely absurd. Uh, I don't think I've ever used it before with rapid fire, but uh, the recoil is really hard to control. But right here, I get into a sticky situation. I pick up the Relentless, and right here, I misread where he was going to go. I should have known the bad player was not going to strafe, and I should have just knifed right in front. 
And uh, honestly, if I uh, would have got him there, I probably would have got my uh, V-Sat, and I probably would have dropped a nuke on these guys. Uh, maybe. it was It's kind of close, but... Uh, yeah, I was just doing the majority of the killing this game because my team was um, not really that good either. And then obviously this idiot <laughs> behind me is still trying to get in my way and like give away my position. But uh, I guess he doesn't realize it's not really doing anything. As he gets killed a lot of the time, I think earlier he also died to a bouncing Betty uh, running into the room when I picked up my dog. So uh, probably uh, not a good idea to be following me around like that. And you see him right there complaining in the chat about it. But, uh, whatever. But, yeah, definitely, if you're finding yourself uh, going against bad teams, i definitely say try out some high streaks. And uh, maybe if you can't get high streaks, run some really good lethal low streaks. Like, the Sentry Gun is really good. Uh, Lightning Strike is great. Uh, so, definitely try those out and uh, try some different things out and see what works for you. But, uh, that's the end of the video. Final score, 37 and 4. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll probably have another video coming out pretty soon maybe today uh, but if not definitely tomorrow so uh, stay tuned for that all right guys i will see you on the next video and i hope you enjoyed if you did leave me a comment below and i'll see you later peace